you guys have done a great job in terms of developing um, your players. I also believe that the, the franchise have had a lot to do with it. It's like I said, it's, it's very impressive. I think IPL has done wonders to see a lot of guys who are bowling very high 80s and, and early 90s. Um, I think you guys have done a great job in terms of developing um, your players. I also believe that the, the franchise have had a lot to do with it because in terms of the IPL I'm referring to, because there's stuff there to motivate guys to to want to do this for a long, long, long time. So they just don't have to, to, to wait to play for India. So they've seen an opportunity to play in the IPL to showcase their talent. And then, of course, that would propel them to play for, for um, India because they'll be on a world stage. So I think uh, you guys have done a, a, a great, great job. Hope um, we can follow. Um, I think in the 220 format, I think from, from judging and, and being around some of our players, I think um, we tend to concentrate for, for, for much shorter periods rather than the, the longer periods. However, um, most of our players are not too too well at rotating the strike to the ball, so they tend to depend on their their, their power. Um, and that plays perfectly in the T20 format. Uh, but it's obviously plays against you in the longer format because you don't really truly need to take that amount of risk. And um, because the game is extended for such a long period in terms of the 50 over, I think once you're given a chance or two and you get out, you don't really have um, much time to recover. So I think um, you have that opportunity to, to play T20 and express yourself. And I think that's what our players try, um, enjoy doing. So I think maybe if they adopt the same sort of mindset, it might be able to, to help our one-day cricket. Well, I, I, it's difficult to see. I mean, I don't really focus too much on, on players or people like Sal and what they do, but I think Generally in the Caribbean, we are very much um, laid back in terms of the way we play. Um, sometimes yeah. it works, works, and sometimes it doesn't. Uh, but I think um, we, as a, a Caribbean people, I think it's important to understand that we also have our own league, and, and we we trying to seek our and find our talent to to come through to to ensure that that West Indies cricket continue to to move forward. Because we know for the last 20, 25 years, we've been a true. Uh, a very difficult uh, period, but yet we've been producing players who seem to be performing at the T20 level and uh, to a lesser extent the 50 over and the um, test matches. But I think ultimately we would hope that the, the CPL, the IPL and whatever cricket they may play would continue to, to let them gain as much experience and, and help them to improve their cricket and, and in bigger picture help improve West Indies cricket.